But there should be a law for drag queens that we just get to do things other people can't. You want to get in that left lane? I know I want to get in the left lane, but you can't. Well, I'm got. I'm not dealing with the left here. I'm gonna go up and then come around. These people, no. You know, maybe I should have stayed in that lane. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I should have listened to you, Michael. Mm -hmm. He's cute. Hello. Hollywood. You know, they need to spruce it up. It's a lot of strange people walking around here. And then they have street performers. One would be cute. They have 17, all playing different instruments. You have a cacophony of sounds. It's not pleasant. There's the Scientologist building. I guess there's a Scientologist station. Oh, they have their own oh. TV. Scientology has a TV show. I don't. Maybe I could get one on Scientologists. <laughs> no, that's not gonna happen. Now I'm gonna go here. Look at that, Michael. I make the right right onto Highland. You see all your negativity. For what? All your judgment, Michael. For what? Look at that cute dog. I hope they have bags to pick up after it. I have these neighbors. They're a little negligent sometimes. And they let the dog poop. And they keep walking. Well, honey, you never saw a drag queen run so fast for that front door. And I tell them, you need to pick that up. I do believe shaming people is, is healthy. Or turning on the sprinklers. That works too. It takes a lot of out of me to walk around with all those tourists coming at me. But how cute, you didn't, you didn't get to see this moment. There was a 13 year old boy from Nebraska who recognized me, he was adorable. And there was the mom from Nebraska taking her little gay 13 year old son to Hollywood. I just, it was beautiful. The world is changing and I'm so happy about it. It makes me proud. I feel like I'm a little part of having made the world a little bit better for those young kids. Anyway, Michael, we're here at your beautiful townhouse. This is where you live. It's lovely.